everybody, welcome back to some more Raft. You guys enjoyed this video so much, I thought we'd do another one now that the game has had a small update. Basically, uh, some bug fixes, the shark has more health, he does more damage, and there are now chests in the game, so we can actually store things outside of our small inventory, so I can stop chucking things overboard. Uh, what I wanted to do today was build a really nice, luxurious mansion raft. So we're gonna call this one naturally, Pimp My Raft. As usual. Oh, it's not. It's too long. Let's see if we do it with that spaces. Pimp my raft. There we go. I uh, get some caps in there. Okay, fine. It won't let me put capitalization. Okay. Pimp my raft. There we go. So we're just gonna try and collect enough resources and build our little raft mansion. We'll probably take about two episodes since this game does take a while to get going to get enough resources. But since we're not trying to build sky high, it should be relatively easy. Hey there, Mr. Sharky. Actually, first thing I want to do, I kind of want to see what kind of damage he can do. Hey, Mrs. Sharky, coming for you. No, 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 That's what I do when I'm attacked by sharks. Ah, ah. Well, they nibble on the air in front of me. <laughs> okay. Well, that was kind of dumb. Let's do that again, shall we? Pit my raft once again. Since we did die, that didn't count. Shut up, it didn't count. All right, I did it on purpose. Let's start hooking. Where are the items coming from? They always come from the same direction, which begs the question, where's all this stuff coming from? Like, who's just dumping all this stuff in the ocean? Or is it just, in my mind, there's a big rock out there that ships are just constantly crashing into, and that's where we're getting all this. Maybe it's like a siren song bringing them in. Where the heck is, okay, there we go. Here's all the stuff, <laughs> I found it. All right, let's start bringing it in. Bring it in. They also did change the hook speed speed and let's see oh it is quite it feels quite a bit faster all right got our first plank look at us go i do want to look at some of the new recipes or the, at least the uh recipe for whatchamacallit the chest uh but i do want to grab this stuff while we can let's get that guy since he's a little bit further away Beep. there we go it does feel quite a bit faster all right so just a couple floating arms holding a hook that's so weird. Why don't I have a body? What exactly is a shark biting if I don't have a body? Oh, here we go. It's a good chunk over there. Yeah, it's a good chunk. Looks like we got a couple scrap. Oh, I missed that plank. Can we grab that? Yay! Okay, we got the thatch. There we go. Toss that there. Boink. Thank you very much. Give me that plank. Give me that plank. Okay, I hopped in the water just for a second. I don't know where the shark is. Oh, it always freaks me out when I don't know where he is. Oh, jeez. Okay. Let's grab this stuff right here. Come on, baby, give me all that. Thank you. Uh, so check this out. So we do have the crafting available, the crafting options for the chest now. So it takes eight planks and looks like ten metal. Okay, that's not bad. It's not bad. Grab that. Grab that. And this is we're going to be building a lot. I definitely do want to stock up on planks. Ooh, we got our first barrel coming in. Sweet. I think the first thing we should work on uh extending the base, chests, and then uh, nets just to catch stuff because it is so super handy just to have a constant supply of crap coming in. Let's get that. Come on. Baby, let's try and get that plank with the two. Hey, hey, we got all three. All right, that should be plenty of stuff. No, hey, what you doing? Actually, we probably should get a spear first just so we can fight them off. Let's go ahead and craft that. We'll take that there. Oh, we got a potato. That's pretty cool. All right. Oh, we should also make a water purifier. We need some more metal for that. Okay, keep an eye out for that. I'm watching you, Sharky. Don't mess with me, bro. Oh, let's grab this stuff. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Up, oh, out of the water. Out of the water. Woo -hoo. Oh, man. <laughs> that freaks me out every time. I know it's silly, but one, I just don't like the, 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 the idea of the deep ocean in the first place. That freaks me out. I think the furthest I've ever gone to the ocean is about this deep. So, oh, man, I just, I just don't like it. I'm not, it's not like I'm super scared of sharks. My sister uh, has always been, she's always been scared of sharks, which has been confusing to us because uh, we grew up in Arizona, so <laughs> there's not like this natural sharks hanging around Arizona. But she always has been freaked out by them. So me and my brother used to like print out pictures or find books with pictures of sharks, and we would just hide them in her room, like under her sheets or on a pillow or something. <laughs> she would get so mad. <laughs> she also was scared of aliens after watching the movie Signs. And so we'd go into her room and draw crop circles in the carpet. <laughs> she would get so mad. This is my older sister, by the way. <laughs> she was like in high school at the time. I don't know why we're talking about aliens now, but I just thought that was a funny anecdote. Hey! Hey! No, you don't. I get the hell out of my stand there and head. Stab you with them spear. You get out of here. Damn shark, this is my raft. You stay out. Ooh! 
Barrels, barrels for days. Thank you. I'll take that. And oh, did I miss it? Oh no, we got it. All right, and get this stuff, and then we'll start building. We desperately need water, so let's go ahead and do that right now. Purifier there. Thank you. Put that down. And then we need some cans. Okay, we got enough for that. Let's go ahead and fill that up and cook it. There you go. Let's also get some more rope going, and then we'll stick out our first. Oh, we need some more rope. Oh, give me that. Give me that. Thank you. Oh, oh, where's he at? Oh, he's over there. <laughs> oh, we'll stick out our first couple of nets. No, we, oh wait, we know we need rope there. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay, here we go. It's a coming. Ooh, that's a lot of thatch. I am rich in thatch. I'm very thatchy. Call me Margaret Thatcher. <laughs> uh, okay, I'll stop now. I'm sorry. Are you coming again? Are you serious, dude? You were just here. Oh, okay. <laughs> Bye. I guess. And we do need a cooking station as well. We got that built up there. Let's go ahead and toss that there. And we do have a potato. Let's toss on our potato. Oh, cooked up potato. Look, our nets are already gathering. But oh my god, guys, it's freaking barrels everywhere. Holy crap. Have you ever seen so many barrels in your life? I know I haven't. Let's grab that one. Can we get the third one? Oh, we got the third one. <laughs> oh, that was quite the haul. Thank you very much. Oh, what you want, buddy? What you want? You coming? Yeah. Oh, ho, ho. Uh, that'll show him to come mess with me. So we got another net right over there. Let's see, can we get a third one actually? I think we need some more rope. We should be able to craft some. There we go. Another net there. No, I don't net. Oh, I don't have enough rope for that. Dang it. It, takes, it needs so much rope. It's kind of annoying. Well, let's just go ahead and grab that. Hopefully there's some thatch in there. That should be good. Yes. Thank you for that. Oh, I didn't even realize we got a bunch of potatoes. There we go. We got three more we can toss in there. Oh, don't eat the raw potato, you idiot. Oh, okay, did not mean to do that. Hmm. Oh, I see the look in his eye. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, you stupid shark. Come here. Die so I can have your meat. Give me your meat. I want to eat. Wait, where'd he go? Did, did I kill him? I don't know exactly where he went, but all right. Got ourselves a hammer so we can start expanding our base a little bit. Let's get some foundation set up here. I'm not pillar foundation. Come here. Come here. Oh, the thing is so finicky. There we go. Oh, we need rope for that. Of course we do. Luckily, we have some thatch over here. Collect that. Ooh, and some more. Actually, before we do that, let's get... Uh, I'm, I'm just going to do something, like, basically like what we did last time, which is ex extend these out as wide as we can, because that'll definitely increase our um, options as we collect more and more resources. Uh, let's drink the water. I always need to leave a spot in my in my taskbar open for the water, because it's always annoying having to move it around like that. And unfortunately, we ate all of our potatoes, so I accidentally forgot to cook a couple of them. So we definitely need to start fishing in order to survive. Hopefully we have enough there, and we do. Uh, I wonder if they change the fishing system. I mean, it's pretty simple. You just sit here and stare. And then three seconds later, the little bubble thingy goes down. Hey, and we got a mackerel. Holy mackerel, that was easy. And then you just stare. Oh, oh, jeez. Stop it, get the fish. <laughs> okay, screw the fish, get the shark. Give me that shark meat. Give me that shark meat. Oh, jeez, it's all flown through. Uh, did not get the shark meat, but we can start cooking our mackerel. Poor little fishy. He stares at you with his dead eyes. I feel, I feel a little guilty, but, you know. He knew the risks. When he signed on to be a fish, he knew that someone would probably try and eat him. I mean, it's, it's, a, it's the way fish's life goes. I'm gonna build some more platforms back here and then see how do we build a chest. Okay, cool. So we can actually do the chest now. Let's go ahead and set that up. Uh, we'll do right there. And this is where we'll still store food. There we go. So we had a little fishy in there. Pick up the cooked mackerel. Eat that. Didn't realize we even had an extra net on us. I guess I built one and didn't actually place it. My bad. Let's empty all these. So cool. So we got the chest. It actually opens. Doesn't that look nice? Ooh, it's animated. Kind of flops. <laughs> I like it. All right. Let's collect all this. There we go. Base is starting to come together, guys. We're getting a little bit sustainable here. Definitely need to spend some more time fishing, though, and just maybe stock up on fish just so we don't have to do it later. So here's my kind of vision for our large mansion raft. And of course, now the shark's coming and interrupt me as soon as I start talking. It's like he's listening to what I have to say. You just stop it, okay? So we got a decent amount of fish saved up. We're still working on that, collect some more stuff. So the, 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 this is gonna be like a big old house. There's gonna be a nice entryway. There's gonna be multiple rooms. We're gonna have a kitchen. I'm gonna make a room for Cormac, my dog, because he wants to join me. So it's basically gonna be a badass mansion out <laughs> in the middle of the sea. We'll probably make this platform like the entrance uh, to the actual house and build it over there. That way we can just leave these nets out there and they won't make the house look all ugly. So we definitely don't want that. Uh, 
the number one most important thing in a survival situation is uh is clearly aesthetics you want you want your habitats to look nice screw safety and warmth and all that stuff you just want it to look nice when you get rescued and those are those news helicopters life start flying around you don't want them to think you're some sort of animal living in squalor you want to think wow that guy he got played a bad hand but it, 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 it's pretty good looking all right it sounds like a fun time and it's so good that people actually come and vacation there after the fact so there that's that's our end game here we're gonna open this up as kind of a timeshare uh hotel where people can come and have the survival raft experience oh we killed the shark! <laughs> I thought he was just coming to attack again. Give me that shark meat. Mm -mm -mm. All right, now we got a little bit more food. That'll be handy. We'll grab this stuff while we're out of here and hop back in. Toss the shark meat in there. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're good on food for quite a while now. Thank you, Mr. Sharky. You see, Mr. Sharky Jr. has come to play. Uh, I don't, don't expect him to last long either. These sharks kind of drop like flies. It's not my fault, man. I'm just holding the spear there. and They're just swimming into it, okay? It's not my fault. Didn't you see the fate of her father? <laughs> why Why are you tempting me? You just stay away from my base. Damn shark. They never learn. All right, so we got 21 foundations to work with now. So we're going to start laying out exactly how we want this to work. So this is going to be the entrance right here. Probably have a nice open doorway. So we're going to expand that way. One, two three four five and from here one two three four five and then from there we can start going back and i think that should be decent sized Let's see i'm just gonna try and step back take a look here see how the how the feng shui is going all right i've been watching a lot of hgtv so i think i know a thing or two i'm basically an expert on home building now <laughs> Let's see, that seems pretty decent. Maybe have that go back a bit. Maybe don't fall in. Ooh, maybe we have a porch. That would be nice. Let's do a couple more there. And a couple more on the other side. So right now I'm just kind of outlining exactly what we're going to be laying out here. It's going to be really, 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 really big. Pretty, pretty big if you ask me. All right. And then at least two or three stories, something like that. I think this would be a nice porch. That might be cool. Let's kind of leave this over uh, not covered, like we're not gonna put a wall here, we'll put a wall here on the inside and then build in from there. That way we can still completely walk around our entire base and hopefully stop the shark as he probably will start chewing on the edges at some point. That makes me kind of want to build the wall because I don't think he'll attack the edges if there's a wall on them? I'm not 100% sure about that. We'll have to ask him. There we go. See, that's what I was worried about. He's gonna go one of these edge pieces and just start chewing on it. You get out of here, buddy. So we'll have to keep an ear route, see if I can hear him. Let's see. So we should be able to repair these, right? Yeah. Damn, he almost took that thing out. Okay. Yeah, he's definitely going to chew on some of these pieces and take them out. Dang it. Well, that's kind of annoying. Oh, there he goes again. There he goes. God. Oh, no, you don't. I wish I could click faster. For some reason, it's not letting me click very fast. All right. You stupid shark. So the foundation is coming along quite nicely. I think... That might be the full size that we're going to do. Maybe one more layer. Because remember, it's only going to be these inner ones. So it's going to be one, two, three, four, five. And maybe one more outer layer should do, I think. That'll probably be nicer. Because that way we'll have uh, six on the inside. That, that should be good. Oh, come on. We're so close. Okay, I just need the four more foundations and we'll be good so that'll leave us one two three four five six by one two three four five six by ten space to build our house in i think this should be good maybe we'll just have the porch up front hmm, cause i can't really think of a need to climb all the way back there i'll think about it i guess because today we're probably just gonna finish the foundation with you guys and then we'll do the rest of the house in the next episode spend some time between episodes and what <laughs> <laughs> collecting resources all those things let's build two more there that'll do one side finished and we just need four more pieces of thatch we're gonna need to save a lot of thatch up because uh let's see oh we did kill another shark by the way off camera so we have a whole bunch of meat there just ate raw shark meat my bad uh we're gonna need a lot of thatch because the actual walls take regular thatch they need just regular thatch not rope uh, which is a little bit tricky. Actually, it'll technically be better than using the rope because it's more efficient. Because we need two rope to make every, or two thatch to make every rope. But now, now you can stay on top of this thing. Here we go. It's a little bit toasty on my toes, but oh well, we'll get over it. Let's drink some water. Grab that. I'll probably add some more nets and stuff off camera as well. 
Just because that's kind of the boring stuff to watch. I don't know about you guys. There wasn't any. Uh, there wasn't any in there. Okay, we got a little bit of thatch there. One more piece of thatch. Come on. Actually, no. I need three more pieces of thatch. Come on. I can't count today. Oh, and there he goes again. Oh, I'm gonna get you. I wonder if this one's gonna kill him this time. Two, three. Oh no, there he goes. All right. I should probably repair this guy. Oh, it does take planks. Oh, he didn't even hurt it. Oh, is this one? Okay. I was wondering what he was doing. He was chewing on the wrong one, trying to trick me. Crazy shark. Whoa! <laughs> it's a little bit of a double jump there. Uh, let's grab this barrel, please. I'm impatient. Come here, come here, come here. Give me some thatch. Perfect. Then we got one here, one here, and that should do it. Let's go ahead and craft those. And plop down the foundation. Oh, not repair. Foundation there. Foundation there. There we go. So we got the foundation of our mansion all set up. Just gotta start throwing up some walls. We'll probably do two or three stories, like I said before. Not really sure yet what I want to do. We're kind of going with a continental uh, craftsman design. Maybe with some nice pillars up front and a porch. Something like that I think will be good. But guys, that is going to be it for this episode of Raft. If you did enjoy, hit that like button, leave a comment, leave something letting me know. I will see you next time. Bye.